Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is going to be about insane soccer. So if you like soccer and you want to get insane, you got to stay with me. Okay, so insane soccer is going to be a class competition. You're going to have to hook into your commander app for this one and you're going to be able to have you know you can set this game up however you want but you're going to see how my class sets up insane soccer so let's go to the soccer field okay here we are at the insane soccer field it's just a first lego league table and you know for those of you that are super resourceful you'll just use whatever you can so i basically split the field up right down the middle we made these goals out of the picture frames and that's all you need. So here's how our um, class plays insane soccer. There's going to be two teams and you guys can figure out how you switch it. Um, but I usually have my students switch off after every goal. You can switch off after a certain amount of time. It's going to be up to you, but it's going to be two teams versus two teams and they're basically trying to get the ball into the opposite goal. So this team would try to get the ball into this goal, and this team would try to get the ball into that goal. Uh, and let's take a look at the robots here, because it's really cool. Um, this one, you can see how they're strategizing to maybe corral the ball. And then they have this large motor here that can be used to kick the ball. Let's go over to this team's robot here. This team kind of has the same thing. This can be used to flip up, to kick the ball. Use this to kind of corral it. This team has kind of the same corral, but this also can be used to flip the ball up. And let's take a look at this one here. Yep, same thing. This medium motor can be used to kick the ball. So here are some of the rules with Insane Soccer. Uh, the robot must fit on an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper. Um, the robot may not trap the ball. So this robot here cannot, cannot get the ball and trap it in here where nobody can get it. The rules state that the robot can trap it within the, the cage here, but it just can't clamp, you know, clamp down on it where nobody can get it. Um, as far as the time frame here, our class, because it's so big, our class is running 37. Um, we have a three minute game. So whoever is leading after three minutes wins. Um, also, if the game ends in a tie, we basically have a shootout where one robot will go up against one robot and whoever scores you know scores a point we switch another uh, two robots will have a shootout if that ends in a tie then we have a third shootout so basically it's just the first team to get two goals sorry yeah the first team to get two goals would end up winning the shootout and thus winning the match so it's really fun um, let's go ahead and go to some of the video that I took of our students playing insane soccer.
guys. So you can see insane soccer is totally insane. It's really fun. The students are, you know, cheering, jumping up and down, especially when the game is tied and it gets real nervous and the next goal wins. So super competitive, super fun. Students love it. And the only issues is you're going to need to make sure that your class, everybody has enough phones. Some of the teams use my phone. Um, that's the only limitation you might have is being able to control the robots with enough phones. Um, luckily, we haven't ran into that problem, so we're looking pretty good. Um, and then, you know, we keep it really competitive too, where we have a listing of everybody's standings. The best four teams will go on to the playoffs. So it's just really neat, um, you know, for the students to be able to compete, have fun, and then definitely, you know, think outside the box with their robots. You know, not only having a, a way to corral the ball, but actually to kick it. Really cool. Okay, guys, hopefully you get a chance to play Insane Soccer. I'm Mr. Hino from Mission Hino's Lego Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. He's out. He's out. He's out.